how to send Facebook leads to Google Sheets absolutely for free and stop uploading this lead data manually. Basically, today we are going to talk about Facebook and Instagram ads automation. So, you started lead generation ads on Facebook through Facebook lead forms. Now, every time a lead comes, you have to go to Facebook platform, into the lead form, download the sheet, get these leads and send them to your sales or contact them yourself. So, it's a very long process, as you see. What if there is a way to automate this whole process? And whenever the Facebook captures a lead, it comes directly to Google Sheets. That is what we are going to talk about today. In fact, the process I'm going to show you is completely free, it will cost you nothing. So, let's get started. I want to show you how to do it using Epiway. First, you need to sign up or sign in to Epiway. After you've done this, go to the tab My Apps and here find and add Facebook Leads and Google Sheets. Now you should scroll up and connect them to your accounts. Let's start with Facebook. Click on the Connect button and one more time and then choose which account you want to connect. If you are not a Facebook Business Manager admin, and do the automation for your client or employer, make sure you are granted full access rights to the page in which the lead form is done. Unless you have all access rights, the integration won't work. Here you need to choose Business page. And next, give to Epiway all permissions, because as you can see, it may not work properly if you turn some of this off. Then click OK. Now you can see this green text. It means that all is correct and Facebook is successfully connected. Now let's do the same for Google Sheets. Go back to My Apps, click the button Connect for Google Sheets. On this page, you should choose which account you want to connect. Here you need to give Appyway full access. It doesn't collect your data, you just need these permissions to be able to edit the files in order to add leads to the spreadsheet. Please pay attention and don't miss it, or your integration won't work. As you tick All, click Continue and it returns you to Appyway. Now both apps are connected, so we can start to configure the integration. Click Create a way. You can give it the name which you need. For example, Facebook and Google Sheets. Here you can see the field Trigger. Here select Facebook. For the Action field select New Lead. So when somebody fills in the lead form, it will trigger the integration to work. I created a lead form in advance. I hope you already know how to do it. If not, there are a lot of videos on YouTube and you can easily find them. So, I choose the page and the lead form, which I want to get leads from. And then click Update Available Fields. And there is nothing in here. To fix this and get your form field, you need to take next steps. Search in Google for Facebook Lead Form Testing Tool. Go to this page and here in the first sentence, there is the link on the tool itself. Click it. This tool simulates the leads coming. Choose the page and the lead form, which you chose in Appyway, and then click the button Create Lead. After that, return to Appyway and click Update Available Fields again. Now you can see that the data has appeared. You can create different fields and they, of course, all will be here. Also, I've created a spreadsheet with the name Facebook Leads. In the first row, I've given names to three columns – name, email and phone number. Returning to Appyway again, now you should specify the action. In the field Choose a service, choose Google Sheets. Here choose Create Spreadsheet Row. It means when you get new lead, the system will fill in the rows in the sheet with information. Then test the connection and after that click Update Available Fields. First select the spreadsheet that you need. Then select Worksheet. Here you can have a lot of worksheets, but you have to choose that one to which you want to add information. For me, it will be sheet number one. And the Appyway shows you fields which you have in your sheet. If there's only one here, just give names to the columns, as I showed you. 
Here click the plus sign and choose full name for name, email for email, and so on. Then click test and activate. If you want to add it this way, you can find it in the tab My Ways, deactivate it and change everything you need. But don't forget to activate it again. Now let's create test lead one more time to check if everything works. First delete it and then create it again. You cannot create a new lead without deleting the previous one. Now I'll go to Google Sheets. Data transfer may take a little time. Sometimes it appears immediately, sometimes you have to wait for a while. The time of waiting is up to 15 minutes, but usually it comes a lot quicker. And you can see that the information is here. It is the data of test lead which Facebook has sent. Name, email, phone number. So, new leads will appear in rows below filling in the sheet. This way, you can easily make integration and automate your work. And of course, don't forget to go to the Appyway website, look through the categories, choose appropriate software for you and make your business process better.